Hello, I'm D and you're watching a tutorial on how to install, register and set up a demo with Avada team. This tutorial starts with WordPress already installed. If you don't have that ready, please install WordPress and then come back to this video. We will start by opening our downloads. From there we find the Avada and download the installable WordPress files only. When that's ready, we'll open our WordPress website, Appearance, Teams, Add New, Upload a team, and we'll choose the file in our PC or Mac. We click install now. After the team is uploaded, we will get the welcome to Avada screen. From here we can start installing the plugins. Fusion Core is first. When that's ready, we will continue with the rest of the plugins. And I just want to note here that uh, Appearance install plugins and Avada install plugins are basically the same thing. And you can install the required plugins from those places. And after that again Avada plugins. I will activate Fusion Core because I missed to do that. The last plugin we need is Contact Form 7. That is for the contact page. While we are waiting, I will talk about the rest of the plugins on this page. As you see, there is a layer slider, slider revolution. WooCommerce, BB Press, and the Events Calendar. You should install those only if you need them. Some of them are heavy and can increase your site's load time. When the last plugin is ready, we can register the team. Avada Product Registration. Generate a token. If you are logged in to your Envato account, you should see this page. Here, we are going to add a token name and the only thing we have to check here is view your Envato account username. The rest are set up already. We'll click on the Terms and Conditions Agreement. We got our code. Copy, paste, submit and we are ready with the product registration. Next is the demo setup. This is a really easy step. Click on install demos. For this site I will be using Avada architecture, but you can install the one you need. After clicking on install, you will see a pop-up which contains the minimum server requirements for demo installation. And we're ready. Let's check some pages on the website to be sure that everything has been set up correctly. Yes, the site is looking really great. This was all for this tutorial and we hope we were helpful.